Hello, brothers and sisters in Christ. I was doing some comments. <coughs> Excuse me. A Corina Maiden put up a comment that says, I will send up a prayer for Matthew. Please, or, <coughs> excuse me. May I please also ask for my brothers and sisters to pray for my son. Um, it, it looks like Joji, but I'm wondering if it's Georgie. At any rate, maybe that's a nickname, Joji. To be healed. He is incredibly ill. He won't eat. And we need prayer. Thank you. I love you all in Jesus Christ. So we have another urgent prayer request. When they get to the point where they won't eat. This is not good. Um, if you wouldn't mind, Karina, adding a, a comment. I'll pin it to the top. With any more details you'd like to share. Like what it is, if you know what it is, is he in the hospital, um, is he got a fever, anything, if you feel like it. Jesus knows. We do know that Jesus knows. And we don't need the details. I just think sometimes when you have them, you can pray against these things. But we can also pray in the Spirit, those who can. And the Holy Spirit knows every detail. All right. I'll end it there. And I um, I pray myself, Heavenly Father, I ask you to go to this lady's son, Joji. And please, Father, let the precious blood of your son flow through his body to saturate every cell for the healing of his infirmities. We don't know what they are, but you know everything. And you know why. Sometimes doctors, they're looking at something. They don't know why. But you do. Why doesn't he want to eat? Is it all stomach flu that is lingering? Lord Jesus, you can make that thing go away right now. In your precious and holy name, I pray, Lord Jesus, that you would let your precious blood be the healing factor in this boy's life. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen and amen. All right. Let's keep praying for him as well. Add him to your list. Thank you, brothers and sisters. Bye for now. Talk to you later.